Do you want an OP tactic that's very simple to make, scores hundreds of goals, and has your top goal scorer in the Premier League getting 42 goals plus a season, winning the Champions League, winning the Premier League, and winning the FA Cup? Then look no further than this video. Let's run the intro. It's a very simple, positive 4 2 3 1 that's been sent in by one of my followers called Zach. Absolutely OP tactic. We've tested it out here with Manchester City. Now let's take a look at the goalkeeper. It's a sweeper keeper attack with dribble more and take more risks. Its left back is a full back attack with cross more often and get further forward. One ball playing centre back, doesn't matter which side you play them on. It's take more risks and hold position. One no nonsense centre back. With short, shoot less often, dribble less, more direct passing, take fewer risks and hold the position. The right back is a wing back on defend, run wide with the ball, take fewer risks, cross from deep and hold position. Moving into the central midfield pairing, it's a ball winning midfield player. With shoot less often, dribble less, take fewer risks, hold position and tackle harder. And then he's supported by a deep line playmaker, the quarterback of this team. Shoot less often, take more risks and hold position. Now, the forward line is an interested one. It's two inverted wingers, one on the left, one on the right. The left has dribble more, cut inside with the ball, get further forward, and so does the right winger. And then it's an advanced playmaker support with shoot less often and take more risks. Simple advanced forward who just moves into the channels, but this tactic really does deliver. And that's mainly down to the in-possession, in-transition, and out-possession. They are just the presets from the Gengam Press, it's totally OP this year. If you've played Football Manager a lot, you know that the 4-2-3-1 Gengam Press is like a cheat code. Now let's take a look at how we've done in the major competitions. As mentioned at the start of the video, we did win the Premier League with this tactic. Winning 28, drawing 4 and losing 6, winning it by 5 points. But the main standout points here is definitely Erling Haaland in the Premier League with 42 goals. The best average rating, the best player of the matches. And Sergio Gomez with 15 assists and Riyad Mahrez with 12. I mean, I've never seen that kind of return from Sergio Gomez before at Manchester City. So that's absolutely class. The tactic also provided the first Champions League for Manchester City with Erling Haaland, top goal scorer. No surprise there. Also third on player of the matches. Edison was third on clean sheets. And they beat Inter Milan in the final to pip the, the Italians to the trophy. The tactic also provided... An FA Cup for Manchester City with Erling Haaland, the absolute cheat code being top goal scorer again. Julian Alvarez being second on assists, joint with Alex Grimaldo, who signed for Newcastle in January. Player of the matches was Erling Haaland as well. So this tactic has provided a domestic double and a European trophy for Manchester City in the first season. The only thing it hasn't done is provided the Carabao Cup. But really, honestly, who cares about the Carabao Cup? Now let's take a look at the squad and how they performed with this tactic. Looking at the squad, there's no surprise that Erling Haaland is top with the goals. 58 appearances, 70 goals, 5 assists, an average rating of 7.70. But this tactic also does spread the goals around the team as well, with Bernardo Silva, Kevin De Bruyne, Phil Foden, Julian Alvarez all getting 10 goals plus, and then other players chipping in with 1s, 9s, 11s, 7s as well. In terms of assists, it turns Sergio Gomez into prime Meza Ozil with 19 assists in 30 starts. Absolutely class. Phil Foden got 15 assists as well. Grealish got 14. Mares with 12. Gundogan, Bernardo Silva, Alvarez, all with 10 plus. Even Rodri and Kevin De Bruyne got eight each. Probably would want a better return from De Bruyne, but it's been absolutely class. This tactic would highly recommend it. Go out and give it a try and let me know below what teams you try it in in the comments and then I'll test it out with them as well. If you don't already subscribe to the channel and if you want to as well feel free to send me a tactic i'll link my email in the in the description below so you can send me a tactic tell me the team you want me to test it out with i'll test it out make a video tag you in it and give you a shout out but until then i'll see you on the next tactics video